Hello! I don't have a way to start these videos. So I think we all have a set of rules. You know, things that we try and keep in mind in our day-to-day -day life. Because let's face it, if everybody went through life doing whatever they wanted, the world would be a pretty bad place. And if you don't believe me, just take a look at some of the people who went through life doing whatever they wanted. So yes, we all have our own personal set of life guidelines. And they can be there for many different reasons. Sometimes they can be there to improve what others think of you. For example, I have to remember to stop singing because I have a terrible voice. I may have personal experience with that one. Or sometimes it could be something to improve productivity. For example, I have a terrible voice so I should work on my singing. In private, of course, because clearly you don't have the best voice. And sometimes it could be there to improve how you act towards other people. For example, the golden rule, do unto others as you want done to yourself. And in my many years, my 14 years, I have a list of these rules too. And I have selected from them the general rules that could apply to everyone. Now some of these rules had their own videos on my channel because they are very in-depth and I'm probably gonna make videos in the future that focus on some of these rules too. But this video serves as a way to get a condensed version of all of them. And here they are. Never be too uptight about following these rules. The idea of this video and having a life rule book doesn't make any sense because life is way too complicated and breaking some of these rules occasionally serves as a good purpose. Always remember to use your judgment when you need to use these rules or not. Don't ever, ever expect anyone else to follow these rules. That's just not fair to them. Being humble will make people like you so much. You could be kind, you could be smart, you could be athletic, but people will like somebody who is humble better even if they're not as good at those things. Never judge, that's it. If you want a full video explaining why, you could click the card because there's more to it than just it's mean, which in itself is reason enough. Try to make it hard for people to judge you. What I mean by that is that even though the clothes that you wear and the products you use and how you speak should not make a difference on how people treat you, it totally does. As stated in the previous rule and the video I just tagged, you should try very hard not to judge people, but you also can't expect them to follow that rule themselves. So try to make it hard for people to judge you, but if they are judging you, that's their problem, not yours. Always try to empathize. Wow, here's another one that has to do with how you treat other people. I promise they're not all like this, but being empathetic will help to strengthen the bonds with everyone you come in contact with. And it will also help you stay objective with everything. Because putting yourself in someone else's shoes really helps you stay objective in every situation. I recommend you go running every morning or at least get some form of exercise during the day. Look at this, we finally have one that helps you in general and not just how you interact with people. When I say this, I do not mean working out because even though that will help you get good muscle, it's not going to accomplish the goal that this rule is here to accomplish. What I'm talking about is some kind of cardiac exercise. I guarantee that getting your heart pumping hard once a day will make you you feel generally happier and more accelerated throughout the day. Even if it's a short period of time, like five minutes, hopefully more, probably not. If somebody says something mean or dumb, try to understand. Because chances are that after they said the dumb thing, they realize that they said a dumb thing and they don't need you to tell them. Seriously, how many times have you said something dumb and a second later you were like, shoot. So try to understand when that happens to other people. Unless you realize that they're constantly saying those kind of things, in which case you may want to mention it to them because they might not realize that they're being mean or stupid. And if they do realize that they're being mean or racist or sexist because they are those things, then... I don't know, you might want to stop hanging out with them. But that's like really extreme and each case is very different. So be careful with how you follow in these sort of situations. A more profitable situation is trying to help them, but you have to be very careful because you might end up causing more harm than good. Anyway, this one is taking way too long and we have to move on. If you want something, work for it. Do one thing a day to get you closer to accomplishing that thing and eventually, I promise, you will accomplish that thing. If you want something bad to happen to you, here's what you need to do. Speak trash about somebody. That's it. Something that I want to mention is that you exist to make yourself happy. Unless by doing so, you are making other people unhappy or causing damage to them or yourself. But something to keep in mind is that oftentimes making other people happy is what is going to make you happy. Always question what you think. Because if you are always ready to admit that you're wrong, you will always be right. Never tattle on somebody, just don't do it. If you have a stomach ache or a stomach bug and you're throwing up and you're in tremendous pain, toast and jelly is the way to go. I just saved you a lot of discomfort during your life. You're welcome.
Always remember that your mistakes, even the most awkward ones, make you just as much as your successes make you. And that is a comforting thought that everybody should keep in mind. As long as you learn from your mistakes, don't continue making mistakes. Don't spend too much money on stupid things, like brand name anything, I say as I film this video with my iPhone camera. But this rule is a big deal when it comes to clothing, because you might think that this new, really expensive piece of clothing looks amazing, but to the people around you that don't know the price, it's just a good looking shirt. And you could have accomplished the exact same thing and have $20 or sometimes $50 extra. Never stop adding on to these rules because your life is always changing and you will always need more rules. For example, when I get older, I'm probably gonna have a lot of rules on responsible money usage. And lastly, the golden rule, do unto others as you want done to yourself. This one is actually a lot more complicated than it sounds and it deserves its own video sometime in the future. But all of these rules being said, it is important to remember the one rule. The idea of a rule book for life doesn't make any sense because life is way too complicated. These were just some things that I try to keep in mind in my day to day life. And hey, I'm curious if you guys have any rules that you try to keep in mind, let me know down in the comments below. And Kiriar, if you're watching this, who is by the way a YouTuber, link in the description below, maybe you would like to make a video similar to this describing your rules for life and feel free to copy some of mine because they were very general. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like the video on your way out and subscribe and hit those notifications so you can get notifications whenever I upload at least once a week. If you liked my video or any of my others, remember to share them with your friends so that they can enjoy them too. And if you like my entire channel, just share that with your friends. And until next time, remember to never beat yourself up for not following 100% of these rules 100% of the time because it's hard to do that. And remember to never let anybody judge you and never let that get you down because you are awesome and I will see you guys next time.